Good morning students how are you i hope you all are well and safe at your home so last time students we have done exercise 1.3 question number 1 i told you to do at home i hope you all have done now moving further exercise 1.3 now we will start question number 2 read it now see student in this question they are saying verify the following 18 multiply 17 plus minus 3 that is in bracket that is equal to this now before starting this question first i am going to explain you distributive property distributive property i hope in video that i send you last time you must have seen in that video i explain this property but right now i am going to explain it again so it should be easily understood you now see first is i am going to this example 12 plus 5 now in this question see what it is it is says 3 times sum of plus means sum 3 times sum of 12 and 5 how we will solve it this is just for the understanding say hi we will say say hi to multiply say hi to multiply this plus plus sign is for hi how this 3 is outside the home you can say this one is your home and this is your guest this is outside the home he has to come inside the home so when he entered the home he will say hi to these persons these are two persons you can say so when 3 will come inside the house he will say hi to 12 then again 3 will say hi to 5 how we will write 3 will say hi to 12 then this is plus so that is why i am writing here plus then 3 will say hi to 5 so this is about the distributive property now next example is this is our first example second example i am taking just an example now this is another example say by say by to multiply so this minus is say by by to multiply how see again Six outside, and he entered the home. Then he will say, uh, in the in that case, he said hi when he entered the home. Now he is going back, so he will say bye to the person who was staying at the home. Six will say bye to four. Minus just for the by six will say by to three. First by to four, then by to three. When you solve it, six into four, twenty four. Six into three, eighteen. And twenty four minus eighteen is six. Plus minus minus sign bigger term. So in this way. you will be able to understand how we will do that property that is distributive property just just this is just for your understanding now we will do question number second of your exercise 1.3 about that distributive property this is distributive property c 18 he will entered the house because here is a sum plus he will say hi to 7 then he will say hi to minus 3 integer 
plus means he will say hi if it is minus then he will say bye to the member of the house so we will do this question question number 2 a part 18 multiply 7 plus minus 3 so this is our left hand side i am not writing writing full question so this is our lhs left hand side is this so we used here distributive property i explain you distributive property distributive property so when we solve it according to the board mass rule first we will solve the bracket so 18 multiply plus minus is minus 7 minus 3 7 minus 3 is 4 plus minus minus sign big gutter 18 into 4 72 so this is about our lhs now rhs 18 into 7 plus 18 multiply minus 3 this is our rhs so according to board mass rule first we will solve the bracket 18 into 7 126 again 18 into minus 3 minus 54 through activity i explained you that whenever positive integer and negative integer multiply answer always in a negative integer plus minus is minus 126 minus 54 is 72 so lhs is equal to rhs hence verify so it is about second question a part second question b part you will be try now next question question number 3 question number 3 see it carefully see for any integer a a is an integer what is minus 1 multiply a equals to very simple we have to just find minus 1 multiply a is equal to you know that whenever negative integer is multiply with positive integer answer is always in a negative integer and that is also our property that is additive inverse of an integer property this property we have already done so minus 1 when multiply with integer we will get minus a this is our property second part this question c here determine the integer whose product with minus 1 whose product is minus 1 is minus 22 it means that minus 22 is the product so c here Minus one. They are saying minus one when multiply to which number? We will get minus twenty two. It is our question. Second A part. They are saying minus one whenever we want negative answer. It means one should be negative, other should be positive. It means here should be positive integer, and we want twenty two. It means positive twenty two. So minus one multiply with plus twenty two answer is minus twenty two. Now B part is about again minus one multiply with which integer so that our answer should be thirty seven. Now see it carefully. Here answer we want positive, and when answer will be positive. See the rule again. positive multiply with positive positive integer negative multiply with negative positive integer so here one is negative so we can't take this case this is wrong so we have to take this case so in this case both are negative so that answer will come out to be in a positive 
सो माइनस थर्टी सेवन वेन एवर मल्टीप्लाई माइनस माइनस कैंसल आंसर विल कम आउट टू पॉजिटिव नेक्स्ट अगेन माइनस वन मल्टीप्लाई वी हैव टू टेल द इंटीजर सो दैट आंसर शुड कम आउट टू बी जीरो यू नो वेन एवर वी मल्टीप्लाई एनी इंटीजर विथ जीरो आंसर इज जीरो एंड जीरो हैव नो पॉजिटिव और नेगेटिव साइन सो दिस इज ऑल अबाउट द क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री सो आफ्टर क्वेश्चन नंबर थ्री नाउ वी विल डू क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर स्टूडेंट्स क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर इज जस्ट अ पैक्ट्रल यू कैन डू इट योर सेल्फ ऑल्सो आई एम जस्ट एक्सप्लेनिंग लिटल बिट जस्ट सी क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम माइनस वन मल्टीप्लाई फाइव वी हैव टू स्टार्ट विद माइनस वन मल्टीप्लाई फाइव राइट वेरियस प्रोडक्ट वेरियस प्रोडक्ट मीन्स सो मेनी प्रोडक्ट शोइंग सम पैटर्न दे हैव टू शो सम पैटर्न टू शो वॉट दे हैव टू शो माइनस वन मल्टीप्लाई माइनस वन दैट इज इक्वल टू वन इट मीन्स वी हैव टू स्टार्ट फ्रॉम फाइव एंड वी हैव टू कम टिल माइनस वन सी केयरफुली क्वेश्चन नंबर फोर दे आर सेंग माइनस वन मल्टीप्लाई फाइव वी हैव टू स्टार्ट फ्रॉम हेयर and we have to come till minus 1 answer is 1 this is about the question now if you see the number line 0 1 2 3 4 minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 i don't need this one see here now see first is about 5 Minus one, minus one. These both are minus one and minus one is same. Here is five and here decrease till minus one. Now see the num number line. From five we will see here five. Before five four we come. Before four three two one zero minus one. So we will take these cases as such. How? Minus one multiply five is five. Minus one multiply four is minus four positive negative integer answer is negative. After four we will take three according to number line that is minus three. Then minus one multiply with two answer is minus two. Minus one multiply one answer is minus one. Minus one multiply with zero. Answer is zero. Then it is already given in question. Minus one multiplied with minus one. Answer is one. So this is our pattern. They were saying we have to show some pattern. It is our pat pattern. We can also write this as. We can also write this as minus four. See minus four. You can write minus five plus one. Plus minus minus sign bigger term minus four. Again before minus four what will come? That is minus four plus one. Similarly, we have to do minus two plus one minus one plus one zero plus one. So it is about the pattern of question number four. So. I hope you have done this question number four. You understood it very well. Now question number five. See, question number five. I will do one part. Rest you will try. Now question number five. See, students, find the product using suitable properties. We have to use the property. This is our question. Now see. First student in this question, they are saying we have to use the property. Why some questions are saying to use the property? Question number five, a part twenty six multiply minus forty eight plus minus forty eight multiply minus thirty six. How? Why they are saying to use some properties? This is because they want we do. Easy multiply, easy calculation, so that answer should come fast. When we multiply twenty six into minus forty, it will take time because here is two digit. Again, 
when we multiply it will take time and then we will solve it it also take time but when we will use the property now it will take less time now see how we will use this property now first we have to see which property is this see carefully is anything repeat here yes minus 48 minus 48 minus 48 is repeat multiply is also two times these two numbers are repeating itself so we will take it as common this is multi this is the property of distributive property you remember distributive property say here minus 48 say hi to 26 again minus 48 say hi to minus 36 48 is the guest he entered the house and they are the person of the house minus 48 say hi to 26 minus 48 say hi to minus 36 it means this is about the distributive property this is guest so it is outside it's not necessary to put here multiply because bracket means multiply then 26 plus is for high minus 36 so here we will write distributive property now we will solve it if you see it will take less time plus minus minus 36 minus 26 is minus 10 why minus 10 because 36 is bigger now minus minus will cancel out in multiply so 48 into 10 answer is 480 480 is our answer so this is about the distributive property now students your homework is homework do practice of exercise 1.3 question number 1 you have done question number 2 to question number 5 I have done only one part rest you will be try then if in case any problem we will discuss it thank you